It's a shape that's made of connecting lines. Let's learn about polygons. The name will tell you the number of sides. Let's learn about polygons. It's a shape that's made of connecting lines. Let's learn about polygons. The name will tell you the number of sides. The word polygon comes from the Greek word meaning many angles. A triangle has three sides and three angles made from straight lines. You see triangles all the time. A triangle has three sides. A quadrilateral has four sides and four angles made from straight lines. A good example is a speed limit sign. A quadrilateral has four sides. A pentagon has five sides and five angles made from straight lines. The pentagon building might come to mind. A pentagon has five sides. A hexagon has six sides and six angles made from straight lines. Hex and six have an X. That's right. A hexagon has six sides. A heptagon has seven sides. And the seven angles made from straight lines. The word hepta means seven. That's right. A heptagon has seven sides. An octagon has eight sides. And eight angles made from straight lines. A good example is a stop sign. An octagon has eight sides. A nonagon has nine sides. And nine angles made from straight lines. Just remember that nana means nine. A nonagon has nine sides. A decagon has ten sides. And ten angles made from straight lines. The word deca means ten. That's right. A decagon has ten sides. All right, kids, it's time for a pop quiz. How many sides does a triangle have? Three. Tri means three. And what about the sides for a quadrilateral? Four. Quad means four. How many sides does a pentagon have? Five. Penta means five. How many sides does a hexagon have? Six. Hex means six. How many sides does a heptagon have? Seven. Hepta means seven. How many sides does an octagon have? Eight. Octo means eight. How many sides does a nonagon have? Nine. Nana means nine. How many sides does a decagon have? Ten. Deca means ten. 